Hello guys, Zuljan here. Welcome back to another episode of Starbound. I hope you guys are having an awesome day today. Thanks so much for all the amazing support on the channel, you guys. As always, if you do enjoy the videos, give me some dab on that like button to show you support. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. So I went ahead and do a little bit of selling since I, uh, since I last played. And I decided that I was going to try for using some bombs in combination of putting my bandages a little bit closer to my, my primary weapon here. Also, uh, I was going to use some mashed potatoes to give myself a little buff here. So as you can see, I have a full belly and bonus health going in here. So let's go ahead and talk and get going here and we'll see what we can do. So the bombs, they take a little while to go off, but uh, they are relatively powerful from what I know. We're going to test it out and see here. All right, here we go. So those bombs didn't hit, they hit one of the guys. Let's see. Hopefully, yeah, they hit pretty hard actually. All right. Let's see, we have our health done. Okay, let's go ahead and shoot. Okay, that gives us a little bit of energy. He's actually almost dead. This guy's almost dead too. Well, not almost dead, but. Ouch. That's what kind of hurts here. Alright, let me see if I can get a few licks in. Alright, heal myself up. Oh yeah, we're not dying this time, ladies and gentlemen. He's a little hard to dodge, but I'm kind of learning. Oh man, he hit me hard. Ouch. Ouch, 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 ouch. <laughs> All right, let's try that again. Nice. Only one left. I think that's all of them. What? Holy cow. That was kind of intense. <laughs> but we did pretty good. It actually helps a lot having myself right here. Uh, the bombs did some preemptive damage, but I think I could have passed without them. All right. Yeah, the, the definitely the winner there was the bandages and where they were located. All right, I don't know what I got for this, but we can go back and teleport back to the Ark. Okay, let's see what they tell us now. Hopefully we get something neat. A super weapon would be cool. Uh, let's go to the right here. Hello. Yay, surprise, knew you could make it. Good job, champ. All right, what did we get here? A decorative trophy and 400 pixels. Is that all? Oh, I thought I was gonna get like some sort of super weapon. Oh man. Okay, so we do need a new tech card to get that uh, that triple jump. Uh, so I think we should start exploring now. I do have some Dura Steel, but I can't really use it yet because there's some things that I need, like batteries and things of that nature. So let's go up to the ship and I'll show you what I'm talking about. I need batteries and copper wire in order to like get the next thing going here. Uh, you can see oh, if I want to upgrade this for instance, I need batteries, silicon boards, and copper wire. Uh, I don't know that I can make any of that stuff with what I currently have. Uh, we can make a refinery, but all that's doing right now is to like trade ores for pixels. So. There's a fossil station, and that is going to allow me to excavate tools and display cases. So I don't think I'm really interested in that. What I really want to do is be able to upgrade this. Uh, so I don't know what I need for Dura Steel bars and stuff, but I do know that going to... Now that I have this EPP upgrade uh, for the radiation, I can go to radiation level planets. So I think that's what I'm going to do. Now, I know we can go to Temperate Stars and carry on the, with the quest and stuff like that. But I'm not really excited about that. I just want to tear up a little bit and maybe then go to Temperate Stars. I'm still debating on where I'm going to take this series and how long I'm going to actually play it. I'm enjoying the game. Uh, it's just that if the quest line is going to be just going to those different societies and finding um, and, and having to scan all that stuff. I don't know. I don't know about that. All right. Let's check it out here. There was... A radiation store somewhere around here. 
Yeah, temperate stores, radioactive store. There we go. All right, so if we go, let's see, one of these. Dangerous is the threat level. I like that. High levels of radiation. No breathable atmosphere, no atmosphere. Uh, so, yeah, I'm thinking, okay, so this brings us into the jungle. I wonder if it has anything like ocean or whatever. This looks like an ocean-covered planet. This is risky. You know, this may be the kind of place that we need to go for that other society. You know what? Let's let's go ahead and go to this one. I have plenty of fuel, by the way, so I could check out one of the radiation planets too. But it's a risky level location, and it's around a radioactive store. So this should be pretty interesting, even though it's not super dangerous. Should be pretty interesting. All right. Oh, and by the way, I threw away a lot of food, <laughs> like uh, almost all of the um, almost all of the meat and stuff that I had actually died off. So that was unfortunate. But we'll get some more stuff here. All right. So yeah, I really want to upgrade these, and I didn't put the sewing machine down or whatever. But I don't think there's any. I think the first thing I'll have to do is like upgrade this bench in order to be able to make batteries and stuff. Unless I could buy like copper wire and silicone, but I don't know. Actually, let me try to craft that. I don't think I can, but I'll, I'll look at it. Let's see. It doesn't say that I have any blueprints available for it. I don't know if I'm going to have to get that from a quest or whatever. We'll see. All right. Down we go. Let's see what's happening. All right. Who are you guys? I don't know what sort of race these guys are. Huh. I have no idea. Let's see. Let me scan a few of these things. I have no idea if this might... Oh, it's green. Oh, wow! Look at this! The clue hints at hidden information. We're already getting stuff for our quest. Okay. So this is Hylotl? Hylotls? Okay. Track quest. That's awesome. Okay, now it does go green. All right. All right. I'm feeling a little bit better about it now. There was only one guy there, though. One guy? I'm hoping that there's more than that. Okay, let's go the other way. Ouch, don't hit me. Let's go the other way instead. And I'll see if I can find, like, some more of these things. Also, I could check that out. Yeah, there's nothing in there. Okay. No, it only looks like one little house. There's got to be more than that, though. I don't know how deep this is or how deep it goes. It looks pretty darn deep. Holy cow. We might need that water upgrade, you guys, to, go, to really go on these planets. At least it goes from like one section to another all right ouch man at least I don't have stamina or whatever while I'm swimming that would really suck okay so I'm gonna need to find a few more of those houses things this might even be a bigger undertaking than I thought too because all of these places look like they're gonna be far and few between unless of course there's a um like there's a big community of it like a group of houses kind of like I found earlier oh there's another house good good I like that let me scan all of this stuff and see if anything registers it should show up green but I don't know oh tell me that this is a whole bunch of them aha uh -huh, alright now we talking interesting they will certainly have a bearing on my research Okay. Yeah, so they do appear green. Can you talk to me? Nothing. Alright, so it looks like these guys are just going to be far and few between. And I'm going to have to go from place to place looking for them. I still can't believe there's nothing else in the ocean. I mean, there may be, but I'm going to need some sort of... Oh, I wonder if... Aha, uh -huh. I can go as low as I want to now with this breathing EPP. I didn't even think about that. Alright. 
Oh, wow. Hello. Dude, this is deep. And we're on the bottom level. What in the world? This is crazy. Okay. I don't see any real kind of monsters either. Also, I could be digging down here. Huh. Well, this is strange. This is really strange. All right, I'll tell you what though. I don't I don't know what I'm going to find down here. I haven't seen anything particularly special yet. I think what I'm going to do is go back up because I don't want to miss any islands with any of those bird people. I like that I could just kind of one shot these things. So it said it's a risky like difficulty level, but I haven't seen anything real risky. Ah, uh -huh, here's one of the islands I would have missed. Okay, tell me there's something up here. Maybe. That's the biggest risk that we got is these little critters with, with like a million eyes. Ouch. Nothing. A whole lot of nothing. I need to find one of those societies, man. Like a whole village full of them, um, full of them guys. Hylot. Uh, is that, how do you say it? Hylotty? Hylotty? Or Hylotol? I don't know. Tylenols. <laughs> okay. At least we move across the water decently fast. Can I mine this stuff? I sure can. I can get all the water I ever wanted right here. I don't know what I'll ever do with it, but I'll I'll buy some or I'll I'll mine some. <laughs> all right, here's something new here. All right. Ouch, man. Yeah, they take a few hits to kill. Nothing major though. I see all these are plant fibers. Still haven't found any of these villages. I wonder if they live in the ocean itself. It might pay to kind of go down there and see. I don't know, it's getting dark now. I have no idea what kind of monsters there are, but we're gonna hit one more island here and see what we can do. Huh. Okay, so island again. All right, let's go back down and see. Since I didn't see anything up top, I'll go down and see. <laughs> There's the guy that I was just attacking that just fell. Fish fingers and fish dumplings. Oh, wow. That's a heck of a fish there. Interesting. Um, let's go ahead and use a little bit of health here can't hear anything down here either it's like I'm underwater all right I think I'm gonna try to go underground here and see because I haven't found anything specific yet I imagine that I imagine there's got to be something like some sort of societies and not just the singular houses but the islands are relatively small all right, there's a chest there. I'll see what that's all about. Is that a chest? No, I thought it was a chest. It's actually just a plant. It fooled me. All right, let's dig, shall we? Okay, so watch this. We'll go ahead and seal this off. And then I think what I'm gonna do is try to just mine this. There we go. All right, <laughs> now we can actually hear what we're doing. Let's see how far we have to go down until we see something interesting. 
probably this far. Ouch. Oh, we found a chest. Yay! Yeah, a matter manipulator upgrade. Don't mind if I do. How close are we on this, by the way? Whoa, we have 28 manipulator modules? All right, hold up. What can we do here? 24. This increases the area 4 by 4 and this increases how fast we go. Deconstruction rate by 200%. I think I'm going to do that. Now we have 12 out of 16. We can increase the range. I still don't think that is going to be too good though. We need 32 to make it even faster. It's already kind of fast. Oh. Okay, you can get titanium here. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's see here. Let's use some health. Where's the flashlight that I had? Oh, you know what? Did I have it right here? Oh, that just shows the flashlight. Okay. I got it. I got you now. Ouch. Well, now we don't need our breathing EPP. We can kind of use the other one. There we go. Now we got a little bit of light. So what's down here? Huh. Might as well grab a little bit of a... Uh, a little bit of copper while I'm here. Okay, so... Nothing real special, huh? Not really. I was thinking there was going to be something. Let's continue down right here and see if we can find anything else. Yeah, this is pretty darn fast now. <laughs> we can dig as far as we like, as fast as we like. Uh, was that... What was that over there? I don't know, it looks kind of... I'm going to go straight up here. Just so I don't get too lost. cobblestone now. What's this green stuff down here? Is this a special place? Oh, there's gold. That's nice. I wonder if you can get anything special down here. Seems to be some mushrooms. Is that what's making it glow? The mushrooms? Glow fibers. <laughs> Oh, this thing just poisoned me straight up. So is that how y'all gonna play, huh? Alright, it actually did quite a bit of damage, too. Yeah, we're gonna need to upgrade the stim packs really, really soon, I'm thinking. Hello, anybody down here? I know I could cheat a little bit and go down like to the left and stuff, but I just want to be able to dig straight up when I get um, when I get tired of this, so to speak. Uh oh, this is all this is collapsing on me. What is it? Mud? All right, that's a little bit better. A little bit better here. Am I full on blocks or something? I am full on blocks. Healing water. I'll tell you what. Let's do... Let's get rid of some of these with lesser quantities. Grassy blocks. Heavy stone blocks. Stone rubble block. I think... That's probably... Uh, I'll keep the mud. I don't know if I'll ever need it for anything, but... Cobblestone brick. I'll keep the sand. Temple blocks. Yeah, that ought to do. Alright, I'll be able to sample some new stuff now. Alright, let's continue downward. Let's see what we can find. It's always very tempting to go as far as you can. alone and we should start reaching something like really different sooner or later like we'll get to the bottom of the um, the world or whatever I didn't even see
see that little guy. This is gonna keep pushing me, I think. I might not be able to go any further like this. I was hoping I could. Aw, oh, you little sucker. Man. Nuisance. Finally, it stopped. It is hard to dig through that stuff, man. So what's the next layer? I'm on some sort of bone now. What is that sound? It's coming from this way. What? What is it? I have no idea. Y'all hear it? It's like a buzzing when I get around here. Oh, there's definitely something here, that's why. Oh, I needed that. Tech card. Oh, it's a saw blade. Oh, hello. Oh, you trying to kill me? Where in the world are we? Huh. Well, this is interesting. Okay. Well, I have a feeling we want to check this out. We've been looking for something. This might be it. It's not the kind of guys that I want to find, though. I want to find, like, the stuff that we can get. Oh, diamonds. Don't mind if I do. Dude, this is some pretty good loot, though. Okay. Hold on. Is this... Does it go down a little bit further? No, it doesn't look like it. There's a ghosts or something. I think he's dead. No, he's not. Beautiful. Give me that. Phase matter? I've got some of that before. Okay, it doesn't look like... It doesn't look like there's much of anything else besides what we just found here. So, some sort of weird torture chamber type place. I have no idea. Alright. I'm gonna grab this titanium while I'm here though. Okay, so, I was like where? Right here? Okay, let's continue to go down. Well, that was kind of interesting. I wish I would have found some sort of weapon there, but the golden stuff is really nice. This is definitely good for money, if I make that refinery or whatever. Alright. Something else to find would be cool. Uh, more titanium. Very nice. A lot of it, too. I guess on these uh, higher level difficulty planets, there's there's much more of it than we need. I'm still hearing that buzzing. Maybe there's a lot more of that stuff around here. Huh. <laughs> like, how deep does this thorn planet go? Am I just going to pop out the other side and have, like, zero gravity and stuff? I'm still hearing that weird buzzing sound, too. Oh, here we go. That hurt. Okay. Well, I still haven't found anything remarkable. I was hoping that there might be some underground cities where those things are. But it does Oh, look. We're on the crystal level. That's where the crystals are. There's lava and stuff down here, most probably. I thought it might be different because it was an ocean planet. I don't think so. Yeah, you can get these crystals over here. That's the crystals that you needed to use to those gateways. Yeah, I don't think there's anything here, you guys. Well, that sucks. 
At least we can go all the way up just easy, like... We got enough blocks to do it, that's for sure. I wonder how much it's gonna take. <laughs> Let's see here. Let me just check it out. It looks like I could go to the left. Ah, uh, you know I gotta check it out. Is this the same place I went earlier? No, this is different. Oh, no, it's not. It is the same place. That gummit. Well, I guess the noise just travels pretty far. Let's go to we were, where we were before. There we go. <laughs> All right. It seemed just it seemed like it was a lot further than it was. See, this is probably the quickest way to find out what's at the bottom of a planet now. If I had that triple jump, it would even be quicker. And then what we're going to have to do is I I guess I'm going to explore the rest of that ocean and see what I can find. I don't really know if it's gonna help anything, but it's better than nothing. I still wanna check out one of those radiation planets here. Let's use some of this uh, moon dust block to get us the rest of the way out of here. All these materials are relatively easy to get. Oh, you trying to throw some at me, little sucker? That's all right. Ouch. <laughs> I guess that's the end of the line for that. <gasps> I don't wanna go all the way down here. Get me out of here, man. All right. Can I get out now? There we go. Beautiful. All right, and this is where the water starts. So... Now, this is going to flood down this hole? It is going to flood. Like, the water is going to drop exponentially. I don't even know if I'm going to need my EPP. We'll see. I have quite a bit of breath. Although I'm not even at the light part yet. Come on, baby. Oh, yeah, I'm going to need it. There we go. <laughs> Oxygen coming back. All right, well, that was a bust, you guys. I was hoping that we would find something, and it turns out that we did, just not a whole lot of it. Ah, and there's another society place. Let's see, does it have anything that I can scan? No. No, nothing green. Huh? Welcome, traveler. Yeah, thanks. Oh, man, now that I have the tech cards, I wonder if I can get one of those... Uh, tech cords to travel on the water. Let's see. It might work pretty good for the spiked ball thing. Uh, let's see. Let's go to the telestop. All right. Talk to our buddy in the tech lab. Oh, actually, all we have to do is select this. Okay, as much as I wanted, like the other kind of techs or whatever I think I'm just gonna have to form a little bit of stuff aquasphere allows us to quickly move across liquids I definitely am gonna enable that all right and it's set so now if we go back up to the ship and then down on the planet for the ocean again I wonder if I wonder how good it is let's go to the right and see also, I'm going to keep this on just in case. It's going to be nighttime here pretty soon. At least some of these creatures don't hurt you. There's plenty of that do, though. Alright. Oh, yeah, baby. So it does... Oh, I can't. I can't jump out of it like that though. But it is faster than just moving just regular. Which is actually pretty good to know. 
So this will help me explore the ocean planets, and I guess that's what we do need, or, or am going to need. Close the door. <laughs> and it looks like there's a few things that we could get here. Is there anything that we can scan? No. Huh? Oh, you got a little bit of money in here and stuff, though. Hey, why'd you open the door? All right. <laughs> okay, I think I think that's our cue to leave here. So this will make it easier to explore ocean planets, and I'm pretty happy about that. It just makes you float and just kind of go across, which is pretty cool. The ball so far is is a pretty cool device, I think. Here we go. F. Uh huh. See that? <laughs> I guess it's the easiest way to explore the ocean that there is, unless you could buy some sort of boat. But if it's anything like the bikes, that kind of sucked. Yeah, let's see. It appears to be... It's a little bit faster. It's not incredibly fast, but it's pretty darn fast. Oh, man. Alright, well, we're going to continue exploring this planet off-camera, I think, you guys, because this is a little bit redundant. But I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you do, give me some dap on that like button to show you support. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos, guys. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Ulgen signing off. And we'll see you next time.